I got a phone call from his brother saying one of the co-workers had called and said that he had fallen. Pretty much knew I, I'm paralyzed. I couldn't move my legs. Well, when I was going into surgery, it was scary, and I knew that I was paralyzed. I didn't know what the outcome was going to be. He was referred by his neurosurgeon. He, he's a guy that will tell you how it is. He's not going to sugarcoat nothing. So. And it spoke very, very highly of you and said, do we want close or do we want the best? And we said, we want the best. He goes, that sunny view is where you want to be. We do amazing things here. So what makes it so amazing is that we change people's lives. We allow people to go home. We're constantly looking to really find the most current and up-to-date equipment that's available to help our patients out. I mean, that's one of the things Sunnyview is known for is cutting-edge technology. So um, we have the rewalk system, obviously, which we're talking about today, but we also have other technology. We have the Therastride locomotor training system, which again, it's another mechanism to help people get up and walk. We have an augmentative and assistive communication program, which is helping people to communicate if they're not able to verbalize. Um, there's different kind of systems you can use for that, where it's more of a computer-generated voice system for some people is one example of that. We have different kind of systems for individuals to help them regain use of their arms. Uh, we have an in-motion robot system, which really helps people to relearn to use their arms, and it also ties into this whole theory of neuroplasticity, which has kind of come into awareness, I guess, for all of us in the last 10 years or so, 10 to 15 years, where we really can rewire parts of the brain to take over for damaged parts. So we're constantly looking at the evidence, looking at you know what's available, and making sure that Sunnyview has that for the patients we serve. We want to look at the benefits that it offers. We want to look at the population it's going to benefit and how that fits into the populations that we see. I remember the first day they were just going to work on standing and just moving a little bit with the crutches to figure out my balance because it's a, it's a new thing. That went well. We stood up and I did the balancing and I'm like, wow, this is so much easier than, than these braces I'm wearing. And um, so they're like, well, do you want to try walking? And I was like, well, absolutely. Um, so we did. We walked, and it was, it was good. I'm used to walking with these braces and trying very hard. But that, it's like less work is more. Like, like really. That's what I discovered. I was like trying so hard, and then I realized, well, I don't have to. You know, from day one when I got here and I realized that my injury was incomplete, I, uh, I said, well, I got a chance. It's, it's a slight chance, but I got a chance. So I can tell that all of the people here care, you know. You know, the therapists push me, and that's good. They believe in me just as much as I believe in myself, which is good. They are wonderful, and I've got to say, you go some places, you need to see people that act like they're there for their paycheck. Do you know what I'm saying? They all seem to be into their job. Like, they really, really care about what they're doing, and they're really trying to help, and I am so impressed with that.